welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are doing great today i am really excited with this video this is another collaboration video and this is exciting products that i'm going to review today for you guys i think one of my old videos i did review one of the products that's the same like this but it is a different brand all right guys in this video i am going to review this eyelashes perming kit from think Zio. This one here. This is DIY perming kit and I am going to show you guys in this video the step by step how to do this. Like what I said, I did the same review in my previous video. That's why I have a kind of idea how to do it. But before opening this package, I want to also tell you guys that I'm going to review their three gorgeous lashes. So I have here the Luxury Lash of Pink Sayo and this is called Run The World. So this lash is here. This is so pretty. And the second one is the Eight Game and this is how it looks. All right. And then the last lashes that I'm going to review today for this video is they call it Adore Me. So this lash is here. All this product here I am going to review for this video. All right. So let's begin. All right, guys, before we start reviewing this product, I want to introduce you first to their company. The name of the company is Pink Zio and uh, their website is pinkzio.com. Pink Zio connects people through beauty, sharing, passion, innovation, and expertise. Their company provides a wide array of lash-based products ranging from false lashes to lash lift and lash extension. Their missions and objectives centered to integrity, quality, and creating positive vibes and also aiming to inspire creativity to enhance the beauty that you already have with our custom-made lash product that gives your eyes the best experience. So Pink Zio's vision is to establish itself as a premier lash company by creating the best customer service while elevating our integrity as we grow, as they grow. In this website, guys, you can see a lot, a lot of products here like perming kit, hair removals, paw lashes, and you can pick the different products of lashes. They also have no burning eyelash extension glue remover. That's pretty cool. So if you want to check out their website, I'm going to put that in the description box down below and uh, you can check the different products, okay? All right, so let's move on to the product itself. So last week they sent me this eyelash perming kit. I think we are going to do the perming, uh, the DIY perming kit first before I uh, review their lashes, okay? So let's do this first so we can see um, the difference. I don't have anything in my lashes right now. I did not put any mascara or you know anything that can make it a little bit um, Attractive. I don't really have attractive lashes. My lashes is so thin and short <laughs> Okay, so let's open this package here. The packaging is really nice really cute super girly All right, so this is how the packaging looks like and this is how the products look like all right We'll do that in, whoops, in a second. Okay, so you have this uh, perming lotion here, and then you have the setting lotion. That's the blue one, and the yellow one is the moisture lotion, and the clear one is the cleanser water. So you have three of the perm solution, you have three of the setting solution, and then you have two of the moisture solution and then you have this to cleanse water all right so this one here is the eyelash glue this is a number five and uh, by the way how to do it the last time that i did this to thing of uh, the diy perming uh, uh, kit um it's by number that's why they put like they put number in every bottle so you know what's the next solution you need to apply all right and this one here is i think to just to clean up okay this is to apply the solution here and you are going to pick the size here let me open it so you guys can see it so this one is gonna go to here i'll show you guys that later all right and uh, in the package you're going to have this as instruction so let's move on and try this product Okay. Number one, cleanse the lashes. Or you can use a protein remover or oil-free makeup remover. So I'm going to use my Neutrogena uh, makeup remover. Then the second is apply the shield with a silicone pad or a roller. A on that, like under the second instruction, 
apply the glue to the underside of the shield. Then you may need to trim the shields of the end if they are too big. I'm going to do first this side here so we can compare my normal lashes and the uh, lashes that we that I already trimmed. Yeah. yeah, now it's zoom and then you can see all the pores in my face right now, my skin. <laughs> all right, so let's start cleaning my my leads. Let it dry. While waiting, we are going to pick one of this and match it with my eyelid. The problem of my lashes is like it's very like thin and short in this corner. That's why it's so hard to do that. That's my struggle on the last, on the first time that I did this. I think it's better to apply it over here. I'll do my own, uh, <laughs> my own thing. So you have to apply it like that. Make sure that it's thick on your eyelid. So the shield is thick on my uh, eyelid. Now we are going to apply again this glue in the outer part of the shield, all right? So it says there in the instruction that if you need you need to really do it like, well, sometimes you really need to do it like uh, one section at a time so the lashes will not be like stuck together. Okay, let's try this one. We have a hard time to do the corner. I don't know, like uh, my lashes is like so, so thin. But hopefully you, you will, uh, get the corner of my lashes i want to make sure that they're not stuck together the last one i did this is like it's terrible all right apply from solution one apply from the base to to the mid section of the lashes so this is very important instruction it says like from the base to the mid section all right and then apply as close as the base as possible for the best Lip. And I have to leave it for 10 to 15 minutes depending on how thick the lashes are. I'm probably gonna do it for 10 because I'm not, I don't have that thick lashes. I think I'm just going to use this one here. Let's try this, using this one. Let's set this for 15 or 10 minutes. Then let's see what's gonna happen, okay? So I use the solution, the first, the number one, and then instead of using this little, um, white stick wait I don't know <laughs> I just use this one here it's easier for me because I have really like short lashes or thin lashes so I hope this thing's gonna work all right so we're done with the solution one and let's uh, wait for 10 minutes all right guys now it's 10 minutes I look really weird all right so let's move on to the next Step. So the instruction is clean with dry cotton bud. Uh, take care not to wipe over the tip of the lashes in case they become unstuck. So I don't really have Q-tips here. I'm not prepared. I'm just going to use one of this here. So let's try to clean this. They didn't say use the clear water or use anything. It's just to remove, I think, those two chemicals. So this is a thing that you have to have a Q-tips or cotton buds in your kit. So the next step is apply this number two setting lotion. All right, let's read instruction. So apply the setting lotion, apply the blue fixing lotion in exact the same way as the perming lotion. So we are going to do that on the base to the middle as well. If you really have like a thick lashes or long lashes, you can apply it all the way up to the tip of your lashes. So leave that for 10 minutes and then clean again with the dry cotton buds. I don't have cotton buds. I don't know if you can apply this generously. It can help or give you a good result. I'm not sure about that, but let's just follow the instructions. Okay, we're done with the solution number two. And let's sit that for another 10 minutes. Total of 20 minutes. And if you have long and thick lashes, well then you need 15 minutes, all right? All right guys, so we are done with the 10 minutes and uh, now we are moving on to the next step. So the next step is clean with the dry cotton buds or Q-tips and then apply the moisturizing lotion, which is this one, the number three, the yellow one, and then leave that for another five minutes. So that's total of 25 minutes, okay, all in all. So let's do that. I'm going to use again this one. I don't know if this is going to help to clean, but I don't have 
cotton buds here. All right, so let's move on to the moisturizer or the moisture, the moisture solution. At least this one is only for five minutes. All right, guys, so now we are done with number three and we are just going to wait for five minutes again, all right? I'm so excited to um, show it to you guys the lashes because it is really cool. They have like, a different style but what I love are the lashes they are full lashes of course you can use it for different location all right guys so I'm in the middle of the process of this to perming kit DIY perming um, lashes actually the perming kit is really good it is not difficult to apply I have a little trouble with instruction because what like what I said I did this um, in my previous video and I kind of compared instruction but then I just follow this step by step you know there's like Number one, two, three, four, five. So you have this number here in the solution that is easy to follow. The time that you're going to spend here, now I'm spending 25 minutes just to do this DIY perming kit, okay? The smell of the solution, it compared to the other product that I tried, this is not really smelly at all. Like the other one, it is super smelly and strong. But this one here, I didn't smell anything. Like it is a normal smell, I guess and that, that's really good for me now five minutes is over and then let's move on to the next step and after that wipe excess away and the lashes should be easily unattached from the shield now all right let's clean this again using this one okay let's remove this ouch okay there you go all right guys so i have to clean my eyelids using this to Cleanser, cleanser water remove that glue that I put there so okay guys I have to zoom in the camera so you will see the difference so I really have problem here because it's really tiny I have lashes it's really tiny here in this corner and it's super uh, thin I don't think that that is uh, the product's fault it's my lashes the glue cannot hold that lashes for a long time so that's why it did not Get again that corner and that happened too on the other video that I did okay so that's the difference right now so look at these lashes I know don't judge my lashes okay my lashes is so thin and short so this illusion does really did a good job because I really have like what I said I really have uh, problematic lashes in this corner here is really a problem here so I don't blame the solution or the product with that because that is my forever problem. I don't really have lashes here. Okay, and then this one here, compare to these lashes, look at that. You can see the difference, right? So what do you think about these lashes or this DIY perming kit for our lashes? Let me know if you like it or if you don't. But for me, I like it, it does work. I just really have a very thin and short lashes, that's it. All right guys, so what I'm going to do right now is to just finish this one here so it will not look really weird. And after that, we are moving on to the lashes, okay? We are going to review the lashes and their lashes are very gorgeous. Can't wait to show that to you. And uh, yeah, so let me finish doing this the perming DIY thing in my, in this part here. And I'll be right back. All right, guys, so now I'm done with these lashes here. This is really good and it really looks amazing compared to how it looks before with my thin and, you know, short lashes. I love the result of this. I love how it looks right now. But this one is more up and a little bit kind of wide in my eye. And this one here, it's just kind of like in a normal, natural look i only did 10 minutes for this so if you guys really want to make sure that it's going to um give you that effect i think you need to do more than 10 minutes but i like how it looks right now so let's see if this is going to look more gorgeous if we're going to put mascara on later but for now we are moving on to our falsies i'm so excited because they're all gorgeous so let's do it all right guys so i'm back and I did my eyeshadow a little bit so it will not look weird because um, remember earlier I removed my eyeshadow so let's continue this review okay so before anything else if you guys want to check this product please go to the description of this video and you will see their link there and that will going to bring you 
to their website all right okay so let's move on to their beautiful lashes they're gorgeous i'm going to try first to adore me so this is adore me <laughs> okay so the lashes is the luxury lash of pink zayo what you can do is to measure and trim the lashes and apply the pink zayo lash glue liner i think we are going to use the other glue liner in this product here tips never get your lashes wet never pull lashes hair and keep lash in pink zayo box after each use okay so let's go and check this out so this is the lashes here um you can actually pull this out here so you can easily get the lashes i want to show you guys what the lashes looks like okay so this is the lashes here it is really pretty it looks natural and uh, it, it, it doesn't really look uh, overwhelming to your eyes there's a little bit of natural look in these lashes so this is the adore me lashes adore me <laughs> okay so i'm going to try this right now and i will give my honest opinion about these lashes all right so let's do that all right so i'm going to use this one too let's put the glue on these lashes i want to put it in the middle this is so gorgeous i love the length i don't have to trim these lashes i love the volume of this it's pretty Let's try the other one. All right, so this is the lashes right now. It is super pretty. I have to zoom this camera again so I can show you this super gorgeous lashes. This is really pretty. It's not that exaggerated, exaggerated lashes. Okay, so we are moving on to the next lashes. This is the Run the World lashes. All right, so the lashes looks like this. This is the same packaging. You also have the instruction at the back and it's really gorgeous i think this one is more volume than the first one all right let me show you so this is how it looks it's so pretty i love it look at the 3d effect of that lashes it's super gorgeous it's perfect for all the occasion it's not that exaggerated yeah let's go try it on okay so this is how it looks I'm gonna fix this one here because it's kind of sticking out. Okay, if you're gonna use these lashes, you're gonna run the world. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to zoom this to here so you guys can see it. This is how it looks right now. It is really nice. It's really gorgeous. I don't know why this looks more up and this leg looks more down. Let me see. My opinion about these lashes is still pretty, still gorgeous. I like it and. Uh, for some occasion, this is not really exaggerated lashes. Um, I think I'm going to use these lashes for kind of like a formal occasion or for birthday parties or for dinner. This is so gorgeous, it's so perfect, guys. For your makeup videos, come on. You don't have to think anymore. This is really gorgeous lashes. Okay, so what do you think about these lashes? Let me know. And once again, if you want to check these lashes out, please go to the description of this video and then you guys can see the link there and that will bring you to their website. Okay, check this out. This is so gorgeous, I promise. So let's move on to the next one, all right? All right, so these lashes, this looks like this, so gorgeous. And look at that in the middle. Compared to the other one, this lashes is more kind of like a uh, pick in the middle than the outer side of the lashes. The 3D effect of these lashes is so perfect. Okay, so let's try this on. All right, so look at that. So pretty. And look at the middle, it looks like thicker than the than both sides, the outer side, right? Compared to the previous lashes that I showed you guys. I think these lashes is for formal location. It does really give something to your face like that look really gorgeous and uh, yes probably in your wedding in your birthday parties or in your um quinceañeras i mean this one is really perfect i love it so what do you think about these lashes let me know and if you guys want to check this out please go to the description of this video and i put the link there and that link will bring you to their website come on guys check this out and it's really pretty 
Yes, I'm going crazy with these lashes. I love their product. That's it for today's video, everyone. And uh, that's all I have for you today. And of course, I hope you guys like this video. And if you end up liking this product, please go to the description of this video. There's link there. It will go to direct you guys to their website, okay? And for all the products that I reviewed today, all in all, they are good. Priming kit is good. It's just that the corner of my lashes, you know, it's a problem. I have very thin and short lashes there and like what I said I did try this before and did the same thing but the solution does work and of course the three gorgeous my favorite uh, falsies is really pretty and I do recommend this guys this three here little angels okay you can use this anywhere you have it for your formal occasion birthday dinner date or you know upcoming holidays Come on, it is game changer. I love these lashes. All right, so I'm going to end this video right here. And thank you, thank you, thank you so much for watching. And we'll see you guys on my next video, okay? Please stay safe and God bless you all. Bye.